doi got the doi. The doi got that much better. <laughs> the doi day. Yeah. The day got that much better because now there's two dogs <laughs> <Doi>. on on <laughs> two, set. Two beautiful dogs. That's yes. a great doi here. It's a good doi. <laughs> Susie, who's that? Look, look at that. This is Dexter, and he is an owner of Surrender, the person who had him for three years. He's mm. a little male multi poo. Moved into a space that didn't allow animals. So we, oh. we asked if we. So he's he's not had the trauma of the shelter and the bad experience. So he's a, a wonderful little boy. He's available at Wilders, and all that information is on HollywoodSteals.com website. But I want to make mention and just thank Hallmark and our executive producers and you and everyone. And we give people an opportunity to donate a dollar on our website um, to go towards the animal rescue. In the last four months, we've rescued 108 dogs, and that's uh, and found homes for them. So right. that is in large part due to this show. Yes. Well, thank you well, all. Thank you. And the viewers. So we're very appreciative. You are doing a wonderful thing. Yes. Well, thank you, you really are. And I can't imagine having to say goodbye to a pet I've had for I three know. years. Can you imagine? And, and years. Because we're moving into And especially a good one like this. Yeah. A really good one you like this. You guys need a dog? No, but, but I'll tell you something. You got my dollar. <laughs> Surely, you have our yeah. attention. Do I? Yes. Okay. You know, today, earlier, when I was planting our fake tree in a container, I believe I have uh, some footage of, of me taking some cuttings from the base of the tree. Sometimes you get these extra uh, little sprouts. Go ahead and cut them, get at least six to eight inches and remove all of the leaves and then place it in potting soil just the way I'm doing right there. And I'm gonna show you even more. This is going to be a future tree. The only thing is it doesn't have any roots. So in order to encourage root growth, this is what you do. You're gonna remove all vegetation. Take off what? the leaf. Oh, it looks so sad, Charlie Brown. I would throw that out oh, if that were in my house. Right. I okay. really would. I would right? be like, that's okay. gone. This is your future tree. It's been watered. Then you're going to place your greenhouse, as I've shown you before. How about a, a beautiful assistant? You got it. Thank you. I'll help you. And then you, thank you, my dear. How about holding it? <laughs> See? This, now you're going to place it on top of something warm. Oh, either so you just put it in the trash bag. That's oh, exactly no, no, no. what this I was saying. This is a greenhouse. Been, yeah. You're going to put this on top oh, of your cool. uh, TV or maybe your microwave where it's warm. Because in order for this to become rooted, you need to grow roots. And roots need warmth. Mm. So in about three weeks, you know, come and check it. You know, make sure it's moist. But in three weeks, you're going to take that off. You're going to tug at it. If it resists, it's got roots. And guess what, baby? You got a new fig tree. Yeah. 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 All right, Jenna, you now have a new assistant to your left. Oh, okay. uh, yeah. Well done. Uh, Shirley, now you have to be the, the assistant, oh, yeah. Jenna. Okay, all right, here we go. Put the dog on my lap, would you? If you wanted to make a flower ball, you okay. didn't have typing paper, you want to come up with something different, you could take an old book, and you could use some old weathered pages and then get that really vintage, kind of aged, lovely look. Or if you wanted to make one for your daughter's bedroom and she liked purple, you can change to any other color that you want and still Beautiful. print it and download it. So colors, textures, and that kind of stuff is the best way to embellish that design. That's wonderful. Wonderful. Thank you. All right, Dr. Janice and Molly. Yes. Mm -hmm. Actually, one of our dogs wrote a book. And it's called Educating Humans, and it's a fun, colorful book just about the dog's life from a dog's point of view, and no dog dies. It's really funny, and it just each chapter just talks about the fun things about being a dog. And we give 100% of the proceeds go to charity, and it's various charities. That's we can certainly give this to you, too. Yes. Wonderful, yeah, wonderful. You can find on our website. In fact, a special treat for all of you, Dr. Janice is giving away copies of her book. Five lucky winners, uh, viewers actually, randomly selected. All you have to do is uh, follow us and retweet our tweet at, uh, at Bugsy Wonder Dog. And uh, you can uh, check out the stuff on our Twitter page at Home and Family TV. Uh, Soapy. Sophie, oh, Mark, you are so misbehaving today. If you decide to make these, these beautiful soaps, you can get a start even this early on your holiday gifts. If you make them, keep them in a cool, dark cabinet, and they'll, they'll keep beautifully for six months to a year. So get started now. You know when I call you, Sophie, it's just for clean fun. You know that, right? <laughs> Up next, we have some undateable friends sitting here on the couch, and they have some wonderful marketing advice when we come back.